What's up YouTube? Welcome back to another video here on Mquan Reviews. I'm Mquan and today started off like any other normal day. I went to work, dealt with some emails, then I got an email come through and the day turned very interesting very quickly. So I've just driven back down from Dubai and I've spent the last two hours with the guys at Apple, one-to-one -one time with the brand new iPhone 10. And just as I was about to leave the door, I got handed this. Mm-hmm. The brand new iPhone 10, the real deal. This is no dummy, this is no fake, this is the real thing here that I'm gonna be unboxing for you guys. So here it is guys, check it out. <laughs> I still can't believe that I'm actually unboxing this early for you guys. A big shout out to the guys at Apple, particularly the Apple Dubai team for hooking me up with this thing. Um, in this video, I'm going to give you an unboxing and first kind of quick first impressions. Okay. The full detail review, as well as focus on things like the camera, uh, face ID, all that stuff will be coming in a separate video. So if you want to see those, make sure you hit subscribe so that you're notified whenever those videos go live. So this is the box guys. This is it. It's an iPhone 10 on the front, uh, as you would expect. You've got iPhone font over there, you've got the Apple logo over there, and this particular model is a 256 gigabyte version. Now, there's no wrapping around this because Apple have removed the wrapping already for me, so I'm gonna be using this day to day. That's it, there's no indication here if it's a white, or sorry, if it's a silver or a space gray iPhone 10. So we'll have to pull up the lid to find out. That's the lid to one side. We get the usual design by Apple in California and a whole bunch of useful stickers, yay! Even more stickers to add to my collection. But this is gonna be important because remember this brand new iPhone 10 has a new system of authentication and it also has a uh, basically no home button. So I think these, uh, for once, the instructions included might serve well for a lot of people, but that's included there. This particular model is a UAE model, so it means that the, I think the only feature disabled on this is FaceTime, but other than that, everything else still works the same. Right, what do you think this is gonna be? A silver or space gray? Drum roll. Mm, ta -da! <laughs> wow, that is a space gray version that is stunning look at that okay let's put that to one side we'll take a closer look in a moment the uh adapter for charging this is not the quick charge adapter it's just a standard uh, uh charger because we're here in the uae we get the three pinned adapter and then a lot of you were asking whether or not airpods were going to be included we do not get airpods these are the standard uh, ear pods that are included. Plug in your three and a half millimeter headphone jack, so that's included there as well. And then we get the uh, lightning cable over here included. Yeah, remarkably, it doesn't feel that heavy in the hand, but it does feel really premium. But um, guys, it's been well worth the wait, trust me. Wow. Okay, taking you for a closer look at around the device, we've got the volume rocker, we've got the vibrate switch, the stereo speakers down at the bottom, and then you've got your lightning jack. On the other side, you've got the um, side button. Now this side button does a range of different functions. And at the back, you have that dual camera setup with the quad LED flash, um, the Apple logo, just simply the iPhone. Now, the last video that I did, which was the iPhone 8 Plus, uh, a lot of you were saying, hey, this is not a real iPhone, and, and it, that's because you know it has lines of text. Well, here in the UAE, the iPhones will have this line of text and they'll have these uh, symbols and marks, but in other markets, they may not have them there, so don't get too hung up about that. Right, one of the things really quickly, so on the, on the uh, Space Gray version, you can see that stainless steel band is actually, I've been told a surgical grade uh, stainless steel, but that actually has been coated through a PVD method. So that's why it matches the color, which in this case is that kind of gray black color, um, which is very interesting because on the silver version, that stainless steel band remains silver. So that's uh, a difference between those two colors. What a beautiful, beautiful device. Now, while it's uh, powering on, just something that I've noticed in my hand, it's actually really comfortable to use in the hand. I mean, it's slightly larger than an iPhone 8, 
I believe. So it's it's larger all round than an iPhone 8, slightly thicker as well, but a hell of a lot more comfortable in the hand to use than an iPhone 7 Plus or an iPhone 8 Plus. So that's definitely something that I've noticed right off the bat, which is quite nice. And that's the screen. Check out how the screen completely kind of curves over into the edges over there and goes all the way down. Really, really nice. Okay, it says swipe up to open. So let's do that. Okay, so I've got past that screen and this is where I'm faced with Face ID. So essentially it wants you to set up Face ID. So let's go to continue. And this is what you will see. So you get this screen over here and you'll see my face. There's my face. Now this is gonna be difficult to do, but basically I've got to get my face into that square and then I move, I make a circle, a small circle with my nose. All right, can you see that? That works a bit better if I move my phone out of the way. So that's the second face ID setup. So it kind of asks you for two uh, attempts. Let's go to continue. And then I have to put a passcode in there. Let's go for a one that's easier for me to remember. Let's go with a full one. All right, so this is one of the major changes. In terms of going home, you have to swipe up from the bottom and there's a little kind of uh, demo here that lets you know in case you get stuck. So let's go to continue. All right, swipe up to get started. There we go, guys. Finally, 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 I am in. And guys, that screen is beyond stunning. It's absolutely gorgeous. This OLED display, honestly, the first time when I walked into the uh, meeting with the guys at Apple, it completely just, just made me go, wow. I think a big feature of this phone, especially for iPhone users, is gonna be the screen. That is definitely one of the features that is gonna to appeal to a lot of people. Still has, uh, you know, the force uh, touch there as well. Oh, the live wallpaper, that is what we want. Oh, that's nice, that is really nice. Okay, so I've got my iPhone 10 here on the table with the new wallpaper. I'm gonna see how that face ID works because that's one of the key features here. So there's two ways you can access this. One is you can look directly and you have to make eye contact basically with the, with the iPhone 10 but I'm gonna do it the other way first, which is basically touch the screen, look there, and it unlocks almost immediately. So there is now two options. One is I can swipe up to go to the home screen, or what I can do is I can close this, okay? I can swipe up and it unlocks, and then when it unlocks, it takes me straight to the home screen. So there are those two options. Now in the demo, this was really cool because if you get notifications come in, they just come up like, for example, you'll have a notification that says iMessage messages come up. But when you look at the phone itself, that's when that message will be exposed, which is really cool. So I'm really, I'm really keen to test out that feature as well. So let me just unlock this. There we go. Go up, swipe up. Well, you've got to swipe down from the top over here to get to all those uh, settings that you can see here. So that comes down from the right hand side and then you've got everything else here on the left i still need to set this thing up but guys that's it for now all right um what i will do like i said i promise i will do a range of different videos leave a comment down below if there's more that you want to see and um we must 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 test out the camera functions as well because there's some really awesome tech both in the front facing camera and that back camera there as well. So uh, if you wanna see all of those videos, make sure you hit that subscribe button, share this video with your friends, and until next time, I'm M. Kwan. I hope to see you soon again on the channel. From me over and out, peace and blessings.